quick, what is this? It's not Star Wars. It's not a movie. It is a cinematic from a game. Which game? Hint, I talked about it in my last episode on The George Show. I talked about collaborating on... Albion Online. Today I want to feature this game. It just entered closed beta, the final closed beta. They did a character wipe, so everybody starts at level one. And the point is collaboration. Are you playing this game? Is there another game you are playing with members of the Freedom Family or other people? Are you collaborating with anyone? Tell us in the comments below. We will grow faster together as a family if we can collaborate. So why not in-game? Dragon will introduce level one collaboration. Roll it! Hello everybody, this is Dragon. You have been watching The George Show. Dragon collaborated with me by leaving that comment behind me a few days ago. And if you want to get featured on The George Show just like that, click that I to learn all about the levels 1, 2, 3, and 4 of collaboration with me. When you collaborate in-game, do you use TeamSpeak or Discord or Skype, some form of voice communication? If not, head on over to our Discord server. The link is down there in the description below, also to Dragon's channel. And use that to play together, meet new people, find graphic designers to improve your channel banner. They're all on the Freedom Discord server. And click that eye to see everything about the Discord server. Now let's talk about Albion Online. I played this game for a few hours just to get a sense for it. And I must say, it's a really good game for collaboration because teamwork is at the heart of this game. You start just like this, a naked person on an island, and you have to do some simple quests like chop down trees. See, here I am chopping down a tree. It's that simple. You use that to craft your weapons. Everything in this game is crafted by you. You collect all the resources. You level up your crafting skill, and then you join a guild with your friends, hopefully, or new friends. And you work together to create things like tables and chairs in your house, like swords and armor for your adventuring. There is a PvP component where you can fight other people, other guilds, and of course PvE where you can just fight the monsters that the computer controls. This is the skill tree behind me, and when you level up, you get this very satisfying ding. Just by doing actions in the game, your skills automatically go up, and over time, you progress through that massive skill tree I just showed you. When you get laden with resources and you can't walk anymore, this is what happens to you. You start moving very, very slowly. And of course, you can put your horse on, and or you can get on your horse, and you can move a lot faster. But it's really cool how they've put motion and speed as a very important part of this game mechanics. Here is the skill tree again, this time focused on the sword. And when you open up each node, you can see all the benefits you will gain by achieving or unlocking that node. And it tells you exactly what to do and what you get when you do so. And the tree goes very deep when you specialize into specific like just a sword or just a staff. And you can salvage items that you don't need anymore. Like you see behind me, I am taking items from my inventory and I am throwing them into the salvage merchant who will give me back resources. Not all of the resources, but most of them that I got when I crafted the item in the first place. After a few hours of play, your character will look a little bit like this. And what does combat look like? Just like this. You are controlling your character. You have to dodge and move. People shoot at you, do ranged attacks. You have to position yourself and choose the right skills so that you don't die. Here I am almost dying, and I just made it without dying. Dying has very little penalty in PvE. You just get knocked down, and then after about 30 seconds, you can get back up. There are boss fights, and there are tactical flanking maneuvers, also known as run away when you get too much on your ass, and you can rest up and come back and do it a little more carefully so you don't pull the whole room on you. You can also party up with your friends, 
so that encounters like this one are not so difficult. And there are two currencies in the game, silver and gold. There's also an exchange rate, as you can see behind me, that lets you convert silver to gold. The world is quite vast. These are all the different zones that you can visit, and each one has a different level of difficulty and a different biome. You have resources in some biomes that aren't in others, so you'll have to learn that as you play the game. And here are some of your closest friends around you. This could be your guildmates, your freedom family members. You can even buy your own island in this game. Plus, you can have a guild house where you can get everyone crafting together. There's a lot of perks in this game. Tell me in the comments below if this sounds interesting to you. If not this game, do you play a different game that you collaborate with others? We would love to know. Share that on the Discord server as well as the comments, and let's collaborate together. Because collaboration is the fastest way to grow on YouTube. Who am I? I am George Sunpai, Papa George, and my game is really lagging behind me. I am George, CEO and founder of Freedom! Oh, and those names are names that you, the beautiful Freedom family, has given me. If you like this video, click the like button down there. It tells me what kind of content you enjoy. And subscribe to Freedom Central, youtube.com slash freedom. Home of the George Show. I am George, and you've been watching... The point of this video is to talk about collaborations, collaborating with each other to play games together while learning from each other playing the game. You call that an explanation? I am George and even I don't understand what you just said. Try it again. When you equip items, you choose spells just like this. Hey George, you're hiding the spells. We can't see through your head. Really. And we will grow together as a family because this is the Freedom Family. You are part of it, we are all part of it, and we're all growing together. So grow with us and partner with Freedom. That Play Now button right there on the video bar is all you need to click to get started.